Ever wondered what makes the XL Bully breed unique and distinct from other breeds? The XL Bully, a breed of distinction, intrigue, and sometimes controversy, is the focus of our research. A breed with a rich history and unique characteristics that set it apart from other Bully breeds. The XL Bully, known for its muscular physique and friendly demeanor, is a breed that often captures attention and curiosity. This research aims to delve into the depths of the XL Bully breed, exploring its origins, physical traits, temperament, and much more. We will also shed light on the misconceptions and controversies surrounding this breed, providing a comprehensive and unbiased view of the XL Bully. Our journey into the world of the XL Bully starts here, with the intent to enhance understanding and appreciation of this remarkable breed. Stay tuned as we unveil the history of this fascinating breed in the next section, Scene Script. Delve into the past to discover the origin and evolution of the XL Bully breed. The XL Bully breed, a variant of the American Bully, has a relatively recent history, tracing its roots back to the late 20th century. The breed was developed in the United States, primarily by selectively breeding the American Pit Bull Terrier and the American Staffordshire Terrier, along with several other Bully-type breeds. The goal was to create a companion dog with a distinctive blocky head, wide chest, and muscular build while also maintaining a friendly and stable temperament. The breed's development wasn't a straightforward process, though. It involved years of careful breeding and selection to achieve the desired traits. In the early days, breeders focused on producing a dog that was larger and more imposing than its ancestors, while still being a loyal and gentle companion. This resulted in the extra-large or XL variant of the American Bully which stands taller and is generally more robust than the other variants. The breed standards for the XL Bully, as set by the American Bully Kennel Club, have also evolved over time. Initially, the emphasis was on the dog's size and physical appearance. However, as the breed grew in popularity, there was a shift towards prioritizing health and temperament. Today, an ideal XL Bully is not just physically impressive, but also showcases a well-balanced character demonstrating both strength and gentleness. This evolution of breed standards reflects a broader trend in the dog breeding world, where there's an increasing recognition of the importance of a breed's health and temperament, not just its physical appearance. It's a testament to the dedication of breeders who have worked to ensure the XL Bully is not only a stunning sight to behold, but also a delightful companion. With this historical context, we can better understand the breed's physical characteristics, which we will explore next. What makes the XL Bully stand out in a crowd of breeds? The physical characteristics of this breed are unmistakably unique. Typically, an XL Bully can reach an impressive height of 20 to 24 inches at the shoulder, with a weight range between 70 to 150 pounds. Their muscular build and broad chest are features that often catch the eye. The XL Bully shows a variety of coat colors, including brindle, black, white, and various shades of brown. They also sport a short, sleek coat that's easy to maintain. When compared to other Bully breeds, the XL Bully is notably larger, hence its name. This breed is the epitome of power and athleticism, combined with a balanced temperament. Their size and appearance can be imposing, but remember the XL Bully is more than just its physical attributes. Physical traits are just one aspect of this breed, their temperament and behavior are equally intriguing. Is the XL Bully as tough as it looks? This breed is known for its impressive size and muscular build, which may lead some to assume that it has a tough, aggressive temperament. However, the truth is quite contrary to this presumption. The XL Bully is a breed that is typically friendly, energetic, and sociable. They are known for their love of people and the desire to be close to their human companions. Despite their intimidating size, they are often gentle giants who love nothing more than to be part of the family. Their energy levels are moderately high, which means they enjoy a good play session, but are also content to lounge around with their human family members. They are not typically aggressive, but they can be protective if they sense their family is in danger. As with any breed, the XL Bully's behavior can vary from individual to individual. Some may be more playful and active, while others may be more laid back and relaxed. It's important to remember that a dog's behavior is not solely determined by its breed, but is also influenced by its upbringing, training, socialization, 
and individual personality. One common misconception about the XL bully is that they are inherently aggressive or dangerous due to their size and strength. This is a stereotype that has been perpetuated by media portrayals and a lack of understanding about the breed. In fact, these dogs are often gentle, loving and well-behaved when they are properly trained and socialized. However, because of their size and strength, they do require responsible ownership. They need an owner who can provide them with appropriate training and socialization, as well as plenty of physical and mental stimulation to ensure they grow up to be well-behaved and balanced dogs. Understanding their temperament and behavior helps us to effectively train and socialize them, which we will discuss next. How do we guide these gentle giants to be sociable and well-behaved? Training Excel. Bullies is not a task to be taken lightly. Given their size and strength, it's essential to start early and be consistent. Positive reinforcement and patience are key. These dogs respond well to rewards, be they treats, toys, or praises. It's not about dominance, but about building a relationship based on respect and mutual understanding. Remember, socialization is just as important as training. XL bullies are naturally social creatures, but they need exposure to different environments, people, and animals to grow into well-rounded adults. Early socialization helps them learn to react appropriately to the world around them, whether it's a trip to the park, a walk around the neighborhood, or a play date with other dogs. These experiences are invaluable. They not only build confidence, but also help prevent potential behavioral issues. Training and socialization are crucial, but so is understanding their health and care needs. How do we ensure the well-being of an XL bully? That's a question every potential and current owner should ask. Like all breeds, the XL Bully has its own unique set of health concerns and lifestyle requirements. Let's begin with health issues. XL Bullies are generally robust and healthy dogs, but they are prone to certain conditions. Joint problems, for instance, are prevalent due to their size and weight. Hip and elbow dysplasia can lead to discomfort and mobility issues if not managed properly. Genetic conditions such as heart diseases also affect this breed making regular vet checkups essential to catch and treat any issues early. Moving on to diet and nutrition, XL bullies need a balanced and high quality diet to maintain their health and vitality. They require a good mix of proteins, carbohydrates, fats, vitamins, and minerals. Proteins are particularly important for muscle development, while carbs provide them with the energy they need. The diet should also include healthy fats for a shiny coat and optimal brain function. Remember, Every dog is unique, so it's best to consult with a vet to determine the most suitable diet for your XL bully. Now let's talk about exercise. XL bullies are energetic and athletic dogs. They thrive on regular physical activity and mental stimulation. Daily walks, play sessions, and agility training are great ways to keep them engaged and in shape. Without enough exercise, these dogs can become bored and potentially destructive. Therefore, Owners need to ensure they can provide enough physical and mental stimulation to keep their XL bullies happy and healthy. In conclusion, taking care of an XL bully's health requires understanding their specific needs and potential health issues. Regular vet visits, a balanced diet, and ample exercise are key to maintaining their well-being. A healthy XL bully is a joy to have, but ethical breeding and ownership are vital to consider. As we move forward, will delve into the importance of ethical breeding practices and responsible ownership for this impressive breed. What does it mean to be a responsible breeder and owner of an XL bully? It's more than just providing food and shelter. It starts with ethical breeding practices. Breeding should prioritize the health and temperament of the dogs, not just their size or appearance. This means conducting thorough health screenings and considering the temperament of potential parent dogs. Genetic diversity should also be considered to reduce the risk of hereditary health problems. As for ownership, potential owners should consider their ability to provide for the breed's needs. Do they have enough space for a large active dog? Can they commit to regular exercise and mental stimulation? Can they afford potential healthcare costs? And importantly, are they prepared to provide consistent positive training and socialization? These considerations are not just for the well-being of the dogs, but also for the people around them. Being an ethical breeder and owner can help combat controversies and misconceptions, which we will address next.
What are some of the misconceptions that cloud the reputation of the XL Bully breed? Let's delve into this. Our first point of discussion is breed-specific legislation. The XL Bully, like other Bully breeds, often finds itself under scrutiny due to laws targeting specific breeds. These laws often stem from misconceptions about the breed's temperament, leading to unfair treatment and stigmatization. Next, let's address public perception. The XL Bully is often misunderstood due to its imposing size and strength. However, these physical traits don't equate to aggression. As we've learnt, their temperament is often friendly, sociable and energetic when properly trained and socialized. Finally, common misconceptions. Many believe the XL Bully to be a dangerous breed, yet it's essential to remember that behavior isn't breed specific, but largely dependent on upbringing, training and socialization. An XL Bully, like any dog, can be a loving and loyal companion when treated with respect and care. Let's recap the enlightening journey we've had exploring the XL Bully breed. What have we learned about the XL Bully breed through this research? We've seen that the XL Bully is a unique breed with a rich history and distinct physical characteristics. We've dissected their temperament and behavior, debunking myths and highlighting their friendly and sociable nature. We've explored their training needs, health concerns, and the importance of ethical breeding and ownership. We've also delved into the controversies and misconceptions that surround this misunderstood breed. Personally, this research has been an eye-opener, revealing the depth and complexity of this breed beyond surface impressions. It's clear that further research is needed, especially in addressing public perception and breed-specific legislation. It's also crucial to continue to emphasize responsible ownership and ethical breeding practices. Remember, understanding breeds like the XL Bully requires thorough research, empathy, and a commitment to responsible ownership. Let's continue to learn, grow, and advocate for these wonderful dogs. They, like all breeds, deserve our understanding and compassion.